two, three. It's Thursday. <laughs> Can you just two, three? It's, it's Thursday. Thursday. You suck. All right. This week is attraction and relationships week, so I brought, you know, the whore with me. And, uh, <laughs> I would have to say my perfect girl would be, have Nicole from PCD's body, Natalie Portman's face, Emma Stone's humor, and the redhead from House Party. Oh. Yeah. Uh, Carrie Hilson's voice add style so that would pretty much be my perfect girl so crystal what is your perfect girl someone who is really cool looking and mysterious maybe a good sense of fashion really attractive face i really like girls with very stunning faces um, also someone who like who gets my humor because I, I can be... She's pretty funny. Mm -hmm. Someone who's, who's really smart, too. Smart girls are hot. Um, and well-cultured girls, too. <laughs> I like how you describe things about me. And then I just describe things about, like, impossible features. <laughs> you're realistic and you're not. I'm just saying, this Whatever. is our perfect that woman. Girls like that exist. Well, my perfect woman is a lot more tangible than yours. I'm not saying I wouldn't go for a lower standard, <laughs> but <laughs> this is just a bad day. I'm good looking. No. Wait, let's answer a different question. <laughs> Tell them how long we've been dating. Three years. We've had <laughs> a for tres años. We've been together. Can you believe? Don't talk like that. So what hooked you on me, Crystal? Well, when I met you, you were all like hardcore rocker girl, and you were all like badass looking, and you had cool ass hair, and... <laughs> Which I thought was pretty hot. You were like really cocky about things too. You know? I'd be like, hi, and you'd be like, what's up? <laughs> yeah, you're cute, whatever. <laughs> and I just like ate it up. But you have money. And I'm poor. That's pretty much the reason why she's with me. No, it's not. Anyways, so what took me on Crystal? <laughs> Nothing. I just liked her ass. It's big. So what hooked me? Sit down. No, I want to be on you. Sit down. I be on Stop. Stop. I like you. Get. Oh. Why I like Crystal so much? I saw her in a play once, and I think that she can act as really cute. She's still my heart. I like girls that have talents. I guess so. Girls that have something unique about them. Ugh. Like my face. Oh, you're just... Get up. Oh. Turn odds. Crystal, what is your turn odds? Good sense of humor and good sense of fashion. That's it? So, I mean, if you're ugly, don't try. She's really low standards. So no, I don't. I really don't. She does. I really don't. She does. I mean, obviously, they have to be good looking in the face. How do you like that? It's over. Being controlled as a turn on. <laughs> so my turn ons are girly girls. I like this thing. I'm added to butchy girls. Tattoos. This girl has a tattoo. <laughs> I like adventurous girls. Weird girls. No, like I like weird girls, but there's weird and then there's weird. Just don't cross that line. <laughs> so what do you think of polygamy? I don't agree with it. Like, if you had other girlfriends, this would not be happening. I say it's okay. You will die. I'm just kidding. Just kidding. You really don't. Love. Love, love, love. Uh, no, I don't think. Wait. Love. Love, yeah, love, yeah, love. Yeah, that's from uh, The Heartbreak Kid. You just did that to me, nigga. <laughs> what would you do if someone cheated on you? 
cut their face down here. So like when it scars, it like scars yeah, it like that. If you get cheated on, it is the worst feeling in the world. I've been cheated on. Who cares about it? The only thing you can do is, is time. There's really nothing you can do actually. In time you will get over it and hang out with the people that do love you like your friends and family. So what else? I've been cheated on. I totally disregarded my feelings about yeah, cheating. Yeah, who cares? Okay. She beats me. Move. Move. Just someone who used you to, like... You know this video's over. 